Ron here with another video on Ron Brown's YouTube channel here. And my B-roll camera day is the DJI uh, Neo drone here with a new firmware update. I will put the numbers down below or up top or someplace. But it just came out the same day the goggles N3 got released. But we're here operating the Neo with the... Um, the, with the uh, Apple iPhone 16 Pro. So we're using the, the app here. And I want to demonstrate a couple of things here. I'm doing a screen recording on the phone. So hopefully that's turned out good here. Uh, it's sort of a low light to this here. Uh, so I got a, a message here. Noise reduction for app recording resumed. So uh, that's one of the things I want to show you. But let's go right here to um, one of the first things. Let's go to the settings here. Um, Camera settings. I hope you're seeing everything I'm doing here. Screen record here. Okay, on top of this resolution, I'm going to go over. Oops. I guess I can't be in the air while I'm doing all this. Three, two, one. Okay, as you can you can see now, um, I put the phone into. Um, uh, 16 by 9 portrait mode and how you do that is um, I'm gonna go to the settings here down below go to the camera settings and you see up top is this resolution 1080p um, 9 by 16 I set the wrong way around uh, so I put you in the vertical video which is the favorite of TikTok and Instagram stars so wow you know um, that's that's very cool and also, you can do this at 60 frames per second, too, as well as 30 and 50. So none of the other camera settings were changeable here. So I'm in, you know, uh, normal color profile. There is nothing else. You do have the option to H264, 265. I'm on a max. I'm in 265. And you could choose aspect, aspect ratio 4 by 3 or the wider 16 by 9. I'm in the, you know, YouTube uh, 16 by 9 world. So, um, yeah. So anyhow, um, we are in... Uh, let's see here. Uh, you know, we are in this mode here. So I, I don't know if this follows you around or does anything here. Yeah, it, uh, you know, it follows you around without me even saying anything. You see, I got the green box on me. So you see, I can't fool it here. It's, it's much faster than me. So yeah, came up real close. I did fall for a second there. So yeah, there's a bit of a low light test here. It's uh, near sunset. We got a big old cloud. So it's kind of a low light test also. Um, so I, I, th I don't you know, I think I'm recording, yeah, I got to stop by some recording video. So let me show you something else here that got added to the, um, you know, uh, to this tour too. Um, but you know what, I have to stop the drone every time because I don't think I can change these settings. Enough. Let me go down to the settings and let me go back into camera settings. And for audio, you can go to what natural, because I'm on natural now. Uh, for audio settings, so that means that you it will let in uh, other ambient noise in the background. I'm in a semi-quiet space for outdoors, but you should be picking up some other background noises. Or if you were in the pure video, which let's see if I can change it. I cannot change it to pure video because I'm in flight, but that would eliminate all the noise. So let me land it and uh, we'll, we'll put pure video on it as opposed to natural. So, okay, so there does a way to make the screen bigger here, and uh, I probably can't do it while I'm, I'm flying. You know, it's a way to go full screen here, and uh, I don't see it. I saw it in somebody's video, but I don't actually see it here uh, on my screen. So let me let me look for that. Okay, you saw it there. Hold on. Okay, if you want to get if you want to get to where you can you go to the whole screen, you go to manual control up here. And then you, but unfortunately, you cannot use that full screen in, in things like the follow mode. You can only do it in, they call manual mode here. So that, that allows you to go full screen. And then you have your sticks like this. So uh, it makes it much easier. See, I'm holding it now. It makes it much easier to uh, fly it like a regular drone. So you actually done it, it, you know, this is much better than holding it, uh, you know, before when you had to, um, you know, hold at uh, you know, vertical mode or whatever. So, um, yeah, I don't know how much, how, how good this looks, uh, being that, uh, you know, this is much of a low light drone. Let's, 
Let's take it out. Maybe how high can we go like this? Maybe we can see the beach. Hey, it just got brighter on my screen. And, you know, I, I, I guess I'm recording this here. Oh, I turned it too. I took a picture. Okay, I don't know if I was recording before. Of course, this doesn't tell you how how high up you are. There goes a, a, a jeep down the beach. You all to the you know right and left. Actually, fly over here. Yes, this is a much, uh, a much better way of improving it. What's this do here on the side? Oh, I found I never, I never knew how to yaw before. Oh, look at that now! Look, look, I, look, I got some uh, nice clouds up there. You know, let's go ahead and stop this video. I'm going to stop this video. I'm going to snap a picture now. Now they know how to get to the picture settings. Uh oh, boy, it's much darker in the picture. Look at that. That's not going to be good for low light, huh? All right, let me get back to the uh, video here. Look how much the video brightens it up here. Let me bring this down to more normal type of uh, camera angle. Okay. Uh, I think we've seen enough here. I don't want to get a super long video here. Let me bring this. Bring this guy down here. Got to do a dual command, bring it down and over at the same time. Didn't respond well to dual commands here, but maybe it's just a user error. Now I'm walking into the frame here. Okay, let me um, let me see if I can see how I can get out of this mode here. So let me uh. Let me hit this over here. I don't want to land yet. I don't know how. Oh, let me go back to hit one back. Okay, there we go. Now we're back into normal. So let's, can we get out of manual control without stop? Let's stop it and get out of manual control. How about back to foul? Okay, pr hit the little button and there we go. Ops, uh, obstacle avoidance to enable and start button take off. There we go. We're, there we go. Now it's, now it saw me. Now it's actually doing the, uh, follow me mode yeah so that's that's it for today folks uh again a little bit of a low light test here i'm here in front of uh you know good old uh you know the lucy lucy girl here on the beach you see lucy behind me there somewhere um probably not gonna be show you on this one here i'm running low on battery so i'm gonna end this video here so um yeah thanks uh see you the next one